Hey everyone, Nicole here with a quick two minute tip on how to remove the color from a texture layer in your images. Now in my document, I have two layers. I have my background layer, which is a basic black and white conversion with a little bit of a sepia tone to it. And then I have my watercolor texture, which obviously has a nice kind of a greenish brown hue to it. Now in this image, I don't want the color to leak in. I just want the texture in that document to actually appear. So I need to remove the color so that way it's not affecting the overall image. The obvious way to do this is to go up to image adjustments and desaturate. But as you can see, that option is grayed out for me. The reason it's grayed out is because I have my texture layer as a smart object. And I do smart objects with my texture layers because I'm able to easily swap them out when I'm kind of playing around to figure out which one I want. And if I don't want to change that into a rasterized layer, then I cannot use the image desaturate. It's also a destructive edit, uh, but if you just want something real quick, that's a really good way to do it. I'm going to go ahead and jump into the little bit more involved way, which is using an adjustment layer. So the first thing I'm going to do is go over to my adjustments pane and add a black and white adjustment layer. Now you can see over here in the image preview that it added black and white to the entire photograph. Now my original image was a black and white conversion, but it has a little bit of color to it. So I don't want to remove that color. And of course, if you're using a color photograph to begin with, you're not going to want to just straight out apply a black and white adjustment. So what I need to do is I need to make it so that this black and white layer only affects the layer below it, which is my texture layer. There are two ways you can do this. The first way is in the properties panel, just go down and click on this little icon. It's a square with a arrow to the left and down, and that's going to clip that black and white layer to the layer below it. In this case, the texture layer. So now if I untoggle the texture layer, you can see that because they're kind of linked now, it's going to hide both the black and white and the texture layer and remove that color. So I'm only adding the texture to the image. The other way to do it, I'll go ahead and unclick that to remove it is to use a keyboard shortcut. If you hold the option or alt key down, and then hover in between those two layers and click, then you'll do the exact same thing. And that's just a much quicker way to do it instead of having to go over to the panel and click and find that button. And now because I kept this as a smart object and I didn't rasterize it, I can right click and replace the contents and I can even find and play with new different textures to use to see if maybe there's something that I want to use that I like a little bit better.